My name is Kamantuit Moti, and I belong to the White Wolf Clan. And I have some guides that protect me, the lynx, the swan, the hawk. My Christian name is Darcy Linklater. I come from northern Manitoba. I come from a place they call Nistawasik. It means where three rivers meet. And I was, our people have been put there since time started. I can use that number 10,000 years because there's ar archaeological evidence three years ago that proved that. We've existed in our land for more than 10,000 years. I am Nihido. It means that I, my people come from the four directions. Nihido and I speak Nihido language. It means that I speak from the four winds. It means our people speak from the four winds. At the time, the earth was green in our territory. At the time, the water was clear. At the time, there was harmony and balance within our lives and because of our relationship with the Creator through, and our rights that flow through the land from the Creator. That was the time that our people lived in harmony because of the it translated to the great law of creator. And out of that, we have our own customary laws. Some people refer to them as traditional laws. And out of those customary laws, we have our, our customary law principles. One of the principles I'd like to share with you right now is it means that where there's an action, there's an equal reaction. And these are the, the laws and the principles and the beliefs that has maintained our lives, that has maintained our land, our relationship with the land before the, the settlers came to our territory. We use those laws to con probably conduct ourselves as individual people, as families, as a nation. We use those laws to, to provide our own governance, our own structure. We use the laws to govern who we are and to use that law some people today refer it to as common law. But this law refers to a concept that has been carried by your people for so many years. It's a common law of flesh, blood, and bone. It refers also to the animals and the plants, the kingdoms. That is why we we maintain the, our sacredness, our relationship with, with the land, our relationship with our plant brothers and sisters. And that is why there was harmony and, and balance at that time before the settlers came to our, to our territory. <laughs> 